Now, what her grandparents didn't know was that approximately 50 minutes after Carmen left the pharmacy, motorists on Interstate 490 would see a female child naked from the waist down, running away from a vehicle that was backing up towards her. The young child would match the description of Carmen Colon. And at the time, she had been flailing her arms. She had been shouting, trying to get someone to stop, but no one did. The vehicle was described as a dark-colored Ford Pinto hatchback. One witness that had come forward would say they saw a little girl being led back to the car by the driver that had eventually caught up with her. Now, none of these witnesses would report to authorities what they had seen until news broke about her disappearance. So keep in mind, this is a time of no cell phones, no 24-hour news stations, no Amber Alerts. I don't know, though, man. I feel like today, I mean, my hope would be that if somebody saw this little girl running and a car backing up towards her, they would, like, hit the car. Like, I feel like my first instinct would be, like, T-bone the car. 